I felt so worthless, and I was so embarrassed to be your father, to tell you mm -hmm. the truth. Sylvester Stallone is opening up about a hard time in his life. The 77-year-old actor sat down with his two eldest daughters, Sophia and Sistine, on their podcast, Unwaxed, and he shared what it felt like not getting many acting gigs in the early 2000s when they were just little girls. I, I felt so worthless, and I was so embarrassed to be your father, to tell mm -hmm. you the truth, because I... You didn't even know what I did, basically, for a living. We saw your spy kids. Yeah, you, you saw, you know, <laughs> toy maker. Like, what does my father do for a living? He just wanders around looking depressed. Sylvester's daughters also recalled the, quote, depressing time their dad went through while detailing how he spent his days. So for those eight years, when we were growing up and you weren't working, that yeah. killed you. Yeah. And what you did was you'd go into the movie theater, lock yourself in there, mm -hmm for 10, 12, maybe more hours a day and just watch film. And when you explained in the beginning of your documentary how when you were lost, you didn't know who you were, you wanted something or someone to look for, some guidance, you'd go to the movie theater and you'd stay there all day. Right. And I just thought that was such an interesting comparison. I said, maybe you were doing you the same back. thing. You reverted back to the way you were when you were a child, oh my God. You're looking for an answer. Yeah. <laughs> I guess you go back to... We're half you, so... No, because yeah. no. you go back to that womb. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I think you are subconsciously trying to find yourself again. That's the only solace I could find. I, I felt so useless, really useless. You know, you've been at the top of it. Wow, that was a rough time. So I can... I, you know, in one way, people say, oh, I'm glad it happened. No, I'm not glad it happened, mm -hmm. but it made me a much better performer mm -hmm. right? And, and much more sensitive because I realized this is what life is. Mm -hmm. This is what people, they don't have this, you know, happy Hollywood ending. The Rocky franchise star who shares Sophia, Sistine, and a third daughter, Scarlett, with wife Jennifer Flavin also revealed how much they all meant to him during such a difficult time in his career. I realized you... you People that you thought were your friends mm -hmm. are not your friends. When the good times go away, that's when you find out your family is so important. Because I'm telling you, the ship sailed on me. It was pretty yeah. bad. It was pretty bad. But I took all that in, and I thought, you know, if this is if I'm done, and I thought I was, I was definitely done. Phone wasn't ringing. It was done. I, I was so embarrassed because people did not understand Rocky Five. Rocky Five was about one of the more real situations that you're so desperate to not be a failure for your family that Rocky basically gave up his family because he wanted to get glory again, even if it was through another man right. that he for you know his son he gave up his, his wife he was this and that and. I wasn't, I was not smart enough to realize that that's not what people wanted to mm -hmm. see yeah. because that's what happens. Right. You know, that's a little too real. Right. And I said, if I can just go back and do one more, because I never thought I'd ever do another movie again, but in my fantasy, I want to do Rocky Balboa, which is about loss, about mm -hmm. grief which is the hardest thing in the world to live with, girls, I swear yeah. to you. Oh, shit. It, it's, it's hard. The Stallone family are always there for each other and always seem to have a good time together. Axis Hollywood chatted with the fam ahead of their new series, The Family Stallone, back in May. And Sylvester's daughters recalled their very first memory of their dad. The name of the game is Stallone's Uncensored. Get it? Got it. Girls, what was your earliest memory of me as your father? Ooh, earliest memory? Time's up. Thank you. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> I, oh, I think for me, what? one of the earliest memories is literally when I was like, I don't know, two years old, and he put a golf club in my hands. I just like remember you handing me this giant, giant thing. Very good. Out in the You're backyard. Right. And I can't remember right. what it was, but it was I don't it was know, but you're club. swinging. You're still Yeah, good. exactly. You? Um, when you made me read like a poem, you're filming it, and you're on that old recorder, 
And then you'd replay it, you're like, you didn't pronounce that word correctly. Oh. <laughs> it's your earliest <laughs> It was so, so, so long ago. Oh, God, I don't Such know. Such fine memories. Mm-hmm. My earliest memory was... A tape recorder and a golf club. <laughs> yeah, maybe this morning. This morning? Yeah, that's what I said. I don't know. The fondest memory is you sitting in the tree going... No, earliest, right? Oh, earliest. Oh, that was a cute photo. Oh, when, you were, a, oh, when you were sitting in the tree with sure. him. Oh, yeah, I remember that. You put me yeah. in a tree and you left me up there. That's Sweet. right. It was beautiful. <laughs> Who is the peacemaker in the family? Mom. Dad. Dad. Oh. No, Mom, no. Dad, yes. I think Dad. I don't know, sometimes Can you believe, believe that? both. I think both sometimes. Rambo yeah. is the peacemaker. Definitely both. I think both. an idea yeah. how tough yeah. she is. Mm-hmm. All right, I'll ask a question. Go for it. Out of us girls, who's dad's favorite? Now, this is a trick question. Ooh. It's a trick question because I'm the every single day, it changes. he says, I have a new favorite. So who's the favorite today? So yeah, who's today? <laughs> who's the favorite? Be honest. Don't Be honest. say me. Don't, don't say, say Billy. Billy. Don't say Billy. No, no, you. No, what? no. Oh, out of, out, of, out of them? I'm not saying that. Are you crazy? I'm no, you do it. Do, do, it. do it today. Are oh, you don't. armed? Anybody armed? <laughs> okay, my favorite today is... <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, you can't. That's me. Do it. Come on. Oh, I'm, that's the, I'm me. taking the fifth, no, no. all right? No, there is no chance he I'm answering he looked, We all looked at him like this. Is it my oh, turn? They're all like this. I know. Like, like, pick me, pick me. <laughs> Billy. I was so sure he said, all right, Scarlett, go. His daughter, Billy. Okay. 